Greetings everyone. I am Cadet Shivansh Tejashwi, a 2021 pass out from Indian Maritime University Mumbai Port campus. And as all of you have witnessed here, it was a blazing epiphany of innovations, the elaborate melody of ideas, a thoughtfulness for safety, and the hope for a better future for our maritime pilots. I am sure the judges would agree. and of course they have already told it that it was a tough competition also while we are at the judges i'd like to invite them to share their views first of all i'd like to invite mr chitta das sir to share his thoughts thank you thank you uh, shivansh i it was a pleasure to be here to be you know to be part of this program you know <laughs> yeah so good afternoon everybody uh, having worked with a classification society for over 30 years safety is very close to my heart so my compliments to the organizers for selecting this topic about the safe pilot transfer arrangement and the modern idea new ideas uh, this will definitely help to inculcate safe behavior within our young cadets right again i must say that this is a very uh, relevant topic and this issue has not received its due attention in the regulatory regime in spite of frequent accidents taking place the last uh, major amendments to solas on the issue was adopted way back in november 2011 uh, wide assembly resolution a104527 which entered into force in july 2012 that is about 9 years back Uh, similarly we have this iso 7799-1 the international standard which deals with the design and construction of pilot ladders and is referred in solas uh, chapter 5 regulation 23 this has not undergone any innovative changes in the recent past so what needs to be done in the meantime it is spread the awareness what the organizers have done here spread the awareness about the hazards associated with pilot transfer arrangement and of course training training and training i stated training three times why because training for the seafarers not only on the taking practices but also how to follow a proper inspection and maintenance regime of the pilot ladder that is very important right then training for our seafarers on how to look after their own safety while rigging the uh, pilot transfer arrangement but to avoid accident this number of accidents have taken place while rigging itself you know, while arranging organizing the pilot ladder transfer arrangement so please look after your own safety see fires right and that's why training is required and of course finally training is required for all personnel including pilots surveyors ship handlers who are required to use pilot ladders i can give you a very good example here about lloyds register lloyds register all marine field surveyors are required to undergo a practical training which is called working over water training this is basically a practical training on embarking disembarking from boats pilot ladders etc during adverse adverse weather conditions there are dedicated training facilities which have their own wave pools where up to 1.5 meter height of wave a created mechanically and surveyors are required to perform climbing and getting down from pilot ladders both etc right with all safety precautions the excellent uh, you know uh, training uh, practical training unfortunately this is not available in india so our, the surveyors need to uh, uh, you know they travel to kuala lumpur dubai and shanghai where, where such facilities were available so i hope such facilities are created in india in the near future right so coming back to today's event i tell you it was i'm really impressed with the quality of the papers presented today the cadets have done a wonderful job they have really come up with some innovative ideas and even while most of them may not have actually used a pilot ladder in their life but they have really come up with real good ideas so my best wishes to all the participants And including those who did, uh, did not uh, make it to the finals today, apart from those ten papers today, there are many others who didn't make it to the finals today. So my uh, best wishes to all of them and congratulations to the our final ten. Uh, before I conclude, I must add that last month we had a uh, we had concluded another similar event 
innovative event under the uh, under the spices of uh, IMU, which was IMO mock session on Marpol and HTW, organized by IMO, IMEI, and DMECA. That was another great show where uh, the cadets did come up with some excellent ideas. So my compliments to IMU and Dr. Malin Shankar for coming up with all these in initiatives on a regular basis. Right. And I conclude with my with special thanks to IMPA for spreading the awareness on a very relevant topic. Thank you all and have a good day. Bye. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you for sharing your views with uh, all our audience and all the participants. It was really enlightening for all of them.